We found love in a hopeless place. So today I'm giving my official review for Rihanna's We Found Love video. Now, as you all know, I wrote Rihanna Navy Tough. Even though I'm a Beyonce stan, I love Rihanna as well. I'm a stan of hers as well. So, yeah. Just letting you all know that before I get started, so nobody be like, oh, fuck you. Rihanna's awesome. Rihanna is awesome. I'm not saying she's not awesome. I'm not saying the video is bad. The video is great. I actually really, really liked it. I really enjoyed it. I really liked the video. But I do think the video really did remind me a lot of Chris Brown. Not only because the guy in the video had blonde hair, but just because the whole interaction and how they're like in love and then they're not in love by the end of the video and stuff like that. And the whole car scene and everything is everything to me was really subliminal in a way. But it was it was kind of obvious at the same time. I'm not saying that that's a bad thing that the video reminded me of Chris Brown because they had a great relationship up until that night they got into that fight, you know? And they clearly were like deeply in love with each other. So I think that that was a good way to show off the video, you know? But I know that there will be some controversy around this. Just people are going to be like, oh, maybe she's still in love with him, and yeah, 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 and that's probably not going to be the case. But the video itself was great. She got the concept down with the video. As some of you may know, I talked about Bring Spirits' new video, Criminal, yesterday. And I said that how her song matched the video. And this song really matched the video as well, which I really like that. I'm happy that artists are actually starting to make videos that actually go with the song, you know? And the video really went with the song pretty well. It really told a story, and it was interesting. It really just told a story from start to end, and it was really enjoyable. But it really did remind me of the Chris Brown situation. It really did. Like, that's all I kept thinking about. Like, the guy with the blonde hair, the way they was just acting towards each other. They were high off each other. They were silly, acting silly, and all this stuff. Like, I've heard in plenty of interviews where she said that they, you know, that's kind of how her and Chris' relationship was. Like, they were kind of like kids. And I feel like that's, that's what she kind of showed in this video. I loved it though. It was great. It definitely went with the song, you know. So I don't really fault that, and I'm happy that she actually did do it like this. But I'm pretty sure some people are going to try to find negatives with this, like, oh, maybe she's still in love with Chris, and yeah, 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 you know that bullshit. But people need to, need to just enjoy the video and get the fuck over it. They were together, okay? We can't deny the fact they actually did. You know what I mean? Like they were together at one point. And they were in love. So, for her not to be able to talk about it and represent the video is kind of stupid to me. But overall, love the video. Leave some comments below and let me know what you thought of the video as well. And subscribe and rate. Give me a thumbs up, please. I need them, as you can tell. So, subscribe, thumbs up, comment, and I'll talk to you all soon. Peace.